Okay, guys, welcome back to the Q&A part two. Today, we are going to be going over all the questions I got. So, we're going to start with the questions from Dead Salot. So, favorite robots. So, my favorite robots from Robot Wars and Battlebots are going to be Beta, one of my favorite robots. I really like Hammerbots and Axe Robots. Um, Beta, which just really was my favorite from season two. And since that's the, the season I started off in um, of Battlebots, Beta has just been my favorite robot ever since. Um, Willy Big Cheese, also one of my favorites, one of, um, my favorite book from the first series I ever watched, Robot Wars, Series 5, very fun to watch, just really good, um, it was really fun to watch, um, Bigger Brother, one of my favorite teams as well, M not teams, Robots, um, Bigger Brother from Series 5 as well, really fun to watch, I was reading for them the whole entire way through, sad, um, I'm still sad that they lost, to uh, um, Razor, but Razor was, of course, a really good machine, so. No shame in losing to Razor. Um, also, Rotator, one of my other favorites. Rotator, I've just really liked ever since they beat Ice Wave. Because Ice Wave took down one of my favorite robots in Huge. So I've liked Rotator ever since. Um, and also, I was rooting for them with the upset over Tomb. So that was really awesome when I when they won. So, yeah. Um, next question is, earliest member memory of robot combat. My earliest memory of robot combat is watching BattleBot Season 2. Um, I bench watched the whole entire season in one day. I found out about, about BattleBots through a friend, and then I, once I watched once I watched all of season two, I ended up going through some more robot comic videos and finding Robot Wars through Mr. Psycho's live reviews, and up finding more Robot Wars stuff um, through Bluebird Spoof. So yeah. Uh, so those are the questions from Dead Salot. Next up, we have questions from Crystal Carnage. So his question, his first question is ice cream or cake? Um, definitely gonna have to go ice cream. Ice cream and water are just the best combo. Definitely beats cake and milk. So, obviously, ice cream. Also nice and cold. So, BattleBots or Robot Wars? Um, I'm gonna have to say BattleBots. I just start off on BattleBots, which is why I like BattleBots a bit more than Robot Wars. The Robot Wars is a really good show, to be honest. Really close second, though I just think BattleBots, um, BattleBots' format is a bit better than Robot Wars is. So, yeah. Um, the next question is, if I were to ask to enter a custom model into BattleBots, what would, robot would it be? At first I was thinking Scrap Claw, just because there are control bots and you don't see a lot of those in BattleBots. But now that I think about it, I would go with Acid Rain, just because they're a lot more compact and a better crusher. And they're also really nice aesthetic, in my opinion. So definitely Acid Rain over Scrap Claw, though Scrap Claw is a close second for what I would enter into BattleBots. And Crystal Carnage's final question, what I think, it's hard to understand it, kind of, no offense to Crystal Carnage, but I think he's asking, how do I feel about Acid Rain's performance in, um, in Crystal Carnage's series, Carnage Series 3? I'm pretty happy with Acid Rain's performance overall. I was surprised that they went 4-0. That basic, that, that shocked me quite a bit. I was not expecting Acid Rain to do, go for, so, do so well, but when they went out to Unique, I was expecting that. Acid Rain really can't grab onto spinners either. But I was still shocked by how well they did. So I'm looking forward to seeing what they get seeded in Carnage's Series 4. But that won't be until a while. I guess until Episode 4 of the basically Carnage's Extreme Series. Which I will be definitely wanting to know what happens there. But yeah. So the next questions I believe are from the Bot Builder. So here we go. So my favorite like rep um how to my favorite custom build is definitely prestigious Prussian, just because I really like their aesthetic and the um typography for um replica it's it's basically a tie between quite a few robots such as I mean Rhino was one of my favorites they came out looking pretty good um spawn again I was also I was pretty shocked how um I was thought they came the angles came out really well came out looking really good um I'm really happy with Biohazard four bar lifter Cobalt I Dot was amazing. It took me a while to get it right, but it was really good. But overall, I'd have to say Sub Zero, definitely my favorite Robaplica. I'm just really happy with how it came out. Has a very powerful flipper. Should be pretty good for Series One, actually, of the Series Epoch Heavyweight Championship. But yeah, I was really happy with them. So probably my favorite replica. Next question is favorite the bot. My favorite the bot builders models. My favorite of the bot builders models. So that's gonna be really tough to choose actually, because he has a lot of good models. So I'm gonna have to think about this. But if I had to choose, I would go with Scarab. Scarab, probably my favorite one. Just a unique design, kind of apocalypse style, though. Isn't that unique, but it's still really cool, and I really like it. Um, I'm thinking about building my own version of Scarab, actually. It's pretty cool. So, yeah, Scarab, my favorite of the bot builders and models. Next up, we have... If Arden and Prestigious Prussian were to fight, who would win? 
So, he um, specifically said Arden 3000, so not Arden 3.33. That's important because Arden three thousand doesn't have a side doesn't have side skirts, which makes it almost impossible to get under. Unlike Arden three point three three three. So Arden um, three thousand versus prestigious president. I'm pretty sure prestigious president could probably get under Arden and get around it. And did I actually say prestigious president get get under Arden? That is not true. Prestigious president could not get under Arden because they don't have a wedge. But they could definitely get around the backside of Arden and knock them around quite easily, probably doing a lot of damage to Arden. Though I, and Arden's flip, lifter really isn't that strong, so I would definitely say Arden would lose. So prestigious pressure with the win there. If it was against 3.333, like you saw, or, which you saw an image of earlier, then probably lose. They can't, really can't do anything to them since they just have side skirts and they'll just be, keep flipping um, prestigious pressure around. And Arden has a much more powerful lifter now. So, yeah. And the final question is, am I a gamer? And if so, like, my favorite games. So, this is an interesting question. Um, I guess I could consider myself a gamer since I do play, since I do spend over, like, two, an, like an hour playing video games every day. So, um, I don't really have any consoles. I mainly just play mobile. I do have a Nintendo 2DS, though. And I mainly just use it to play like some Nintendo games as well as Mario Kart because that's my favorite Mario Kart game. I also have I, my favorite mo mo my favorite mobile game is Call of Duty though, Call of Duty Mobile. I spend a lot of time playing that game as well as Geometry Dash and Minecraft. As well, I do those two sometimes, but mainly just Call of Duty Mobile. I play that a lot. So the final batch of questions are from Draven T Tigosia. Hopefully, I said that right. So first question is.
and they asked what my favorite meme is. Um, I don't really pay attention to memes, so I'm not sure what like meme like the main memes are right now. Are like a lot of memes, but I guess my favorite one is like the FBI open up meme, mainly just because my friend plays it all the time for some reason, and he does it to troll around with, and he does it to joke with me a lot. So I guess that one. Um, next question is BattleBots or Robot Wars. I already answered that question. BattleBots. Um, next question was how many. Battlebots I have, so I'm guessing that means like Battlebots replicas, so one minute I have to count that. From what I counted, I actually have 17. Now if you're counting the ones from my ter my terrible ones that I've built from like the summer, that's a lot more. But I don't count those ones because I don't use those terrible models I made from that like summer thing where I did like a bunch of robots every single day. So that was also really dumb because I did not put a lot of time into those. But yes, yeah, so overall, if I'm counting the ones I'm actually happy with, 17. If you're counting those ones, it's like almost 100. Um, it's like, let me think, because I did like 67, I believe, plus 17. So yeah, that's quick math. Um, 84 robots, right? <laughs> Hopefully I didn't get that wrong. Yeah, no, I got that right. So like about 84 BattleBots if you're counting the terrible ones I made, but I'm not going to count those ones. So of the ones I'm actually happy with, 17. And their final question is... Favorite YouTuber. So my favorite YouTuber is going to be Inside of Mind. So Inside of Mind is a YouTuber who does a lot of stuff about ARGs, alternate reality games. I just like to watch it because it's good. It's fun to watch. Oh, I skipped one. I skipped the bot builders question. So the bot builders question was favorite non-robot combat show. So my favorite non-robot combat show is probably going to be. Sorry for dropping off of your um, question, Draven, so quickly, but um, probably my favorite non-robot combat show is probably the...